Hey guys, Sunny here. So if you guys want to see how I have created this stunning eye look using the Natasha Denona I Need a Nude palette, then please keep on watching. So I've already primed my lids using a little bit of concealer. So I'm gonna take a brown eyeliner which is really malleable and we're gonna just create a sort of like a cat eye. Don't worry about it being perfect because I'm gonna smudging this off with an eyeshadow. So I'm using some scotch tape as a guide to create that sort of like a cat eye shape. So we are moving into our eyeshadow and I'm taking a small smudger brush and the first shade I'm gonna take is called Silhouette. I'm gonna load the brush and start to smoke out this eyeliner. I'm gonna use some patting motions to keep the product really really close to my lash line. Next, I'm going to take this cool Toby Brown shade called Tender and I'm going to use the same sp smudger brush to kind of smoke it out further. So when you have hooded eyes, the best technique is to kind of use some patting motions and use smaller detail brushes because they're going to be your best tools. I'm going to take a blending brush like this and the next shade I'm going to take is called Wig. This is going to be our overall crease and lid shade. Okay, this is the first time I'm using a Natasha Denona eyeshadow palette and trust me, the eyeshadows are really bomb. They don't have a fallout. So I think the price point of her eyeshadow palette is really fair because they are expensive, but the quality of these eyeshadows are really, really bomb. Okay, I'm taking this eyeshadow towards the inner part of my eye, blending it towards the front of my brow to create a sort of like a deep socket. On my lids, I'm going to use this beautiful rose gold shade called Mia and this looks really stunning. On a same blending brush, I'm gonna take this shade Fair and I'm just gonna blend a little bit more of this harsh line. And this shade is gonna serve as a highlight to my brow bone. I'm gonna go back in this shade called Silhouette and uh, run it on my lower lash line. So I'm taking a little bit of concealer to kind of clean up under the eyes. I'm gonna set my under eyes before applying shit loads of mascara. I'm just gonna reinforce a little bit of blush. Okay, so this is the final look and on my lips, I'm wearing this ultra glossy lip by Colourpop. This is in the shade Lynx Creme paired with a lip liner called Spice from Rimmel. And don't tell me that this doesn't look stunning. If you have enjoyed this video, please give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm gonna create more eyeshadow looks using this palette and much more, so stay tuned for that. And I'm gonna see you guys in my next one. Bye.